boy Donnell Wax, and I'm certified. Yeah. Let's get it. Certified like Elway speeding down Adam's ass. Power steer when I disappear when the police smash them past. 35 hitters up in your crib, imagine that. I beat it like Battle Cat. They go hop out the Cadillac and get some head after that. Hold on, I'ma get some bread after that. Running like a halfback. Bitch nigga, it's the quarterback. Yo, baby mama looking, but I ain't even want that. No chase straight Coney, yeah. You know what, wait, blowing fat. They say California bad. I'm gonna put Dego on the map and they knowin' that I Got a pint in that syrup Pull it down to this perk I got lean stains on my shirt Catch me nodding out off the murk Yeah, we nodding out off the murk And we ain't in the club to dance We be making bottles burst Wait, wait I'm control for the team, nigga I was born in Los Angeles, you know what I mean? Like in the jungles and shit. But, you know what I mean? When I was about seven, eight, I moved to San Diego and shit. So, you know what I mean? I'm a San Diego native all the way. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? I remember writing my first rap when I was like nine, but like actually recording and orchestrating songs, like 12. You know what I mean? I, I used to uh, ghost write for like local talent, you know what I mean? And then that's how I really started building my craft. Yeah. Uh, can't drive, falling asleep at the life, still sipping. Uh, honestly, I, I influenced myself to really start making music. I just that's just something I just like doing after, you know what I mean, just listening to music. But after I really got into it, you know what I mean, of course like Tupac, Ice Cube, like certain artists started to inspire me, you know what I mean, but but as far as the starting process, I just really inspired myself, wanted to hear my voice and wanted to get my point of view out there, you know what I mean? I was always the class clown, you know what I mean? I was always the one that wanted to give you some game or something, you know what I mean? So I will, that's a little better way to get some game or to, through music, you know what I mean? In my own lane, nah, nigga, not quite. Cause I keep swerving, look like I'm merging. My eyes low when I'm murky. Cliches, it may sound, I still say Tupac, cause it's like, whether, Cause you know sometimes you might be blessed with, you might be fortunate enough to start your own business. You might be fortunate enough to sign a record label, or however you came up. But he actually did it how he wanted to do it. Whatever he was, he basically played the card he was dealt. He was in jail, had to sign through death row, woo woo, all that. You know what I mean? So it's like Tupac really, whatever they threw at him, he had to. You know what I mean? He had to make lemonade with them lemons. You know what I'm saying? You know, so I feel like he really made the most power move from reading to educating himself to. To later on, really, basically, you know what I mean, trying to build his own level, you know what I mean? So it's like, he done seen all levels of this shit, you know what I mean? As opposed to some motherfuckers that really just came in, came in, came in a businessman. He had to really make himself a businessman. So it's like, the, the learning process is more valuable, you know what I mean? Low when I'm murking, blowing hydro when I'm murking. No Geico, no insurance, no license under the influence. I'm hella thug life in the bump of my music. I'm high as a high figure. Because you know, I was always observing, so a lot of stuff I learned you know, from my only five, and that's in LA. But then again, like everything I know now and use now, like like San Diego is where I got my game from, you know what I mean? Got my name from, and got my aim from, you know what I'm talking about? So it's like, that's all I really know is San Diego, you know what I mean? Yeah, okay. My pops, my family, they say I still stay out there, you know what I mean? But, like my big brother, rest in peace, you know what I mean? He was born in San Diego, but he was raised in L.A. around the time I was born, because he's like 12 years older than me. So, he actually is the opposite, you know what I mean? He born in San Diego, but he's an L.A. nigga, you know what I mean? So, you know what I mean? It's, it's work like that. Sell her, get your bitch and tell her to hop in my cruise ship. Say way, way too sick. Do spit like a ooze. Yeah, uh, my first my first project I dropped officially was Elway Nowhere in 2010. But I had an album that was before that that was uh, mixed down by Steve Vicious and mastered by Steve Vicious. But it was called It's My Turn. That was like when I was like from a time span from like age 15 through 17. I mean, on and off just recording on my own. But my first actual project was Elway Nowhere. Nowhere. Then, my mixtape I followed after that was the issue two, which is a follow up of my first mixtape, you know what I mean? So I basically got like six projects out, but like 
two that's like officially, you know what I mean? This new album I just dropped, The West Kept Secret, I just dropped in February 2014 and shit. So like, that's really the main focus right now. So I'm pushing that, like that's my only thing. Left old choosy bitch, she got gluteus. I'm gonna move that bitch like ludicrous. <laughs> Can't dry, these niggas ain't live. I'ma keep that shit. Yeah, like it's always gonna be a movement, but it's like, it's really your main focus is the music. You know what I mean, like just show that, show them what real music sound like. It's like it's a lot of half-assing going on. So it's like, like people, people probably do got their certain reason, reason that they really do it for. So we gonna focus right back to hip hop, like good hip hop, no matter where it came from. You know what I mean, you gonna love it. You know what I mean, it ain't regional, it ain't like only West Coast motherfuckers gonna feel it, you know what I mean? We're gonna make sure it's, it's global, you know what I mean? So, and we're gonna make sure you, you hear it, you can hear it, you can hear our intentions, you know what I mean? You can hear that we serious, you can hear that we passionate, you can hear that we been doing this shit, you know what I mean? So it's like, that's the main focus is the music. Of course we're gonna want the bread, but that's gonna come after, you know what I mean? Let the bread chase you. Oh. I'm at the stop sign on trade five, waiting for it to turn green. Hella home like shit though. Fuck with a nigga, bitch. Wanna get up with a nigga cause they like my kid. Yeah, TWKS. So iTunes and uh, Google Play too, you know what I mean? Or you can holler around, holler around your nearest store, you know what I mean? You might got it, might not. But uh, yeah, we got uh, Adonis the Hottest on there, you know what I mean? Fudgelino, got Mitchie Slick on there, Big June, you know what I mean? Trippy hippie, you know what I mean? The whole controllable, the Hus Factor, real honeys. We got it popping up. Y'all motherfuckers better go listen to that though, man. I'm telling you. Stay going this motherfucker though. And I'm on a real fast, go pick up the trap, hit the gas, like, let's go. Wait, wait, I'm on the way. I'm in the pool up, I can't drive. Uh, shit. Elementary school, like, I was like, before I started rapping, really, he got me rapping. I used to be in the sports and you know I mean trying to be I thought I was out in Iris or something, you know what I mean? So he was already doing shows then. You know what I mean? I'm like like I said, I wanted that. Like that's like either that or that, either balling or balling, you know what I mean, or rapping. So it's like I seen what he had and I'm like, that shit's kinda you know what I mean, I can rap too. And I was, it was like after I already wrote my first rap, but it was like I didn't want to be no rapper, I just shit, I could rhyme I was rhyming, you know what I mean? So but after I actually like went to one of his shows, I'm like, man, that's it felt the feeling, you know what I mean? You already know when you get that feeling when it's something, you know what I mean? So it's like that was my something. Been rolling up all day. Take the wheel. I can't try. Fell asleep. That's a lie. Hold up to the right. That's good. Uh, anything OG, uh I can't really pick. That's like saying pick your favorite song, you know what I mean? Like your favorite movie, you know what I mean? But uh I know you can't go wrong with OG. OG, I'm fucking with the uh, planetary, even though that's take we're gonna take it back to the planet, you know what I mean? But I I say I just gotta say OG Kush, you know what I mean? It's around that region. I I go I travel around the world so it's like it's like Everybody got their own shit, you know what I mean? So it's like, every you go everywhere, unless they like New York or something that's really known for music, everybody say, ah, oh, we gotta, we gotta get, you know what I mean? So it's like, everybody gonna have their problems, but when, once that one person blows, it's like, it's gonna be an overflow of Dago motherfuckers, whether who, no matter who think they hot or not, you know what I mean? So it's like, it's, it's not based off of my opinion. So we just gotta work.